Honestly, today was kind of rough. It's one of those days where you wake up to bad news. And I, I'd kind of like to talk about it, but I feel like right now, if I talked about it, it would be very ranty. So I'm just going to focus on gratitude. Uh, it was nice to be able to talk to like-minded people who kind of understood what I was going through. That was nice. Um, I was productive. I came home and I, I cleaned my basement a little bit. Oh my gosh. I was just so surprised by, by what I realized whenever I was down there. I am a box hoarder. So, you know, it, it felt nice to be productive. I'm grateful for the opportunity to do that. And I had my first bubble bath in a long time. I love Lush. If you guys haven't heard of Lush, it is a really wonderful store where you can get handmade uh, bath and body products. Love it. I especially love their bubble bars because I love bubble baths. And so I crumbled up the orange and yellow swirly bubble bar. I I think the name has something like sunny or something in it. And it I crumbled that up in it and um had a nice long bath. Lush is expensive, so Whenever I use it, I really use it. I will sit in the bathtub for like two or three hours. So, what time is it? Hold on. It's 11.30. I got in the bath at, I don't know, it was probably like nine. And I just got out. My hair is wet. I had it pinned up, but the bottom part that was like by my neck is wet. Like, yeah. So this part's dry. This part's wet. Um, smells good. Smells like Lush. <laughs> if you ever walked into Lush or if you ever walked past Lush, you would know. It just smells amazing. Um, so I, I, uh, Got a bubble bath. I'm really thankful for that. I haven't taken a bubble bath in a really long time. And I find them to be very relaxing. <sighs> and I'm so tired. So I think I am going to go to bed pretty soon. I included some clips of my bubble bath. Because I always enjoy when people demonstrate their Lush products. And... And, I don't know, maybe you guys might like it too. It turns the water orange and it's just really fun. I don't know if you guys remember, but I told you I have a bunch of uh, jars, candle jars on the back of my toilet where I keep stuff. I am about to try to feel better about my day with a Lush bubble bath. I just wanted to show it to you guys. This is actually, I think this is um, one of their holiday melts from last year. Yeah, that's what it is. I don't know. Can you see that? It's like the the fairy one that it's like a melt. I might put some of that in there to make it warm. Um, I think this one's called something about sunny day or something. So I'm going to put this in my bath and make it all beautiful and I will show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so I crumbled up uh, half of the remaining bubble bar, so that's about a quarter of a total bubble bar. I totally think that you can get at least four baths out of those things because, I mean, that's a lot of bubbles for just a quarter of the product. And, um, I mean, that's definitely enough for me. And the water is orange. If I do this enough, I'll make more bubbles. And it, it smells good, too. And it feels nice. It feels like okay, I'm moisturizing. So I'm about to take a bubble bath. But I just wanted to share this with you guys because I think this will be 
something I'm thankful for today. Like I said, definitely enough bubbles. <laughs> I, I just laid back and now I've got bubbles like surrounding me entirely, like up to my ears. <laughs> I really like bubble baths. I don't understand when people don't like bubble baths. Okay. The one problem with Lush though is I have to rinse off really well or else I think it's the fragrances or something will make my skin itchy when I get out of the bath. Now I rinsed off like my body but my scalp is itching now because like where the water was on it. So that is one problem I have with it. I don't even have like very sensitive skin whenever it comes to things like fragrances and stuff. And it's all natural fragrances, but I think it's just the concentration that they use. Or maybe it's the fact that it's like a solid and then you dissolve it and then, um, so maybe whenever it dries, it, maybe it leaves like a, like a somewhat solid, like powdery layer on your skin. I don't know what it is, but with my bubble baths, like my bubble bars and my, um, bath bombs, if I don't rinse off really well, I will be itchy. So, uh, hopefully I can get over that. I don't want to be itchy all tomorrow. <sighs> anyway, I hope you guys have a uh, good night. Remember, we are trying to be thankful for something every day in November. So, um, I would love to hear what you guys are thankful for today. I am super tired, so have a good night. Bye.